So I decided to make the switch to Bitwarden's password manager back in January when LastPass informed me they were gonna start charging for their service. If you want to see how to create a Bitwarden account and transfer all of your credentials over from LastPass to Bitwarden, I'll show you how to do that at the end of this video. If you want to delete your LastPass account but can't remember your master password, then skip ahead using the time tags below because I also demonstrate that process a bit later on too. However, for the rest of us who can remember their master password, you can start the process by browsing to lastpass.com and signing in using your account credentials. Before you delete your account, I highly recommend exporting a copy of your passwords. LastPass will prompt you to do this, but you can also do it either from the browser extension or from the main interface. If you have the browser extension installed, click on account options followed by advanced and choose export to CSV. You can do the same thing from the main interface by clicking on advanced options and choosing export. In both cases, LastPass will prompt you for your credentials before either downloading the CSV file or displaying all of your saved accounts in plain text in a browser. Highlight everything and copy the information into a text file. We'll come back to that in just a second, but back in LastPass, we're now ready to delete our account. Click on account settings and then on the first tab, choose my account followed by delete or reset account. When we click on delete, LastPass asks us whether we know our master password, which in this case we do, so I'll select yes. We then get a warning to export our data, which we've already done, so we just need to now enter our password one last time and hit delete. We're asked if we're sure we wish to continue, then we're asked if we're really sure we wish to continue before receiving confirmation that the account has been deleted. If you have the client app installed, LastPass provides a helpful explanation of how to remove it for both Windows and Mac. And if you're using the browser extension, you can now remove that by clicking on the ellipsis icon next to the extension and choosing remove. You will also receive an email confirming your account is now closed. If we go to our text file containing our list of passwords we exported, we can save the file as CSV. To do this, in the save window, set the file type to all files and give your file a name and add a dot followed by CSV to the end of the name. We can then import the file into a spreadsheet such as Excel or Google Slides as I am doing here. Click on import data, browse to your CSV file and you want to choose comma separated as the option. And there we have all our accounts exported from LastPass. I blanked out my passwords for the purpose of this video, but yours should be visible. If you want to delete your account but can't remember your master password, you'll need to browse to lastpass.com forward slash delete underscore account dot php and I'll leave a copy to that link in the description below. After clicking on delete, you're asked whether you remember your password. We'll choose no and we're then asked to provide our email address. LastPass will then send an email with instructions on how to proceed. Within the email is a link, and if we click on the link, we have the option to delete the account. LastPass asks if we're sure we want to delete the account, we'll, we'll click yes, and then we're asked again before the account is permanently deleted. As before, you'll receive an email confirming the account has gone. If you're interested in opening a Bitwarden account and importing your LastPass CSV file into Bitwarden, this is how you do it. Go to bitwarden.com and click on get started to create your free account. Fill in all the details, hit submit, and then log in once more to open up your Bitwarden vault. Once logged in, click on tools from the top menu and choose import data. Choose LastPass CSV from the list of available import formats, navigate to the CSV file in your downloads folder and click import. All the contents of your LastPass vault will now be uploaded and safely stored in your new Bitwarden account. If you haven't already, you can add Bitwarden as an extension to your browser and start using it instead of LastPass. 
So that is how to delete your LastPass account. Before you go, if you are considering starting your own YouTube channel or you'd like to see how I create my videos, I have a free course on my website, which I'll link to below. No gimmicks, it is completely free, so I recommend having a look at that. If you found this video useful, I'd appreciate you give me a like and hit subscribe for lots more quick tips like this one. Until next time, thank you very much for watching.